Hi everybody, this is Phil, Phil Coney, and I'm very excited to be talking to you today about building an Eagle Manager business. The qualification period started uh, on the 1st of May this year to reach Eagle Manager by the end of April 2023. So if you're just getting started in the business, this presentation is going to be perfect for you. Um, to uh, think about getting to supervisor, then getting to manager by around right about October time in the year, and then having enough time to move that manager business from manager to eagle manager, which is uh, which means that you'll be earning more money, you'll be having more fun in your business, and more people will be copying what you're doing in your business and having success too. I'm going to go right the way through the whole process um, in this presentation. If you're already a manager, um, then this presentation is going to help you to make your manager business an above average manager business, then get to Eagle Manager. Okay, so let's, uh, let's dive into it right now. Just a little bit about uh, Rosita and myself. We've been involved with Forever Living now for the past 27 years. We're Sapphire Manager. It's been a life-changing experience for us over the years. We've had lots of time off, lots of travel. We earn a, a, a way above average income, and that's residual, which means we get paid whether we work or not. Um, and it's a very exciting time to be talking to you about this because of the way we are working our business now online with the Global Life Choices Academy and groups that we have available to you guys to help you grow your business. Uh, in the groups that we've got, there is lots of information you can pass out to people, but we feel that it's very important for you to pop the question, for you to actually speak to somebody and ask them the question, just so that you can establish their level of interest in what it is they're looking at. And you can ask this question at the very beginning before you invite them to the groups, or you can invite them to the groups and ask this question during some part of the process when you're tagging them information on part one or part two or part three. At some point, you need to pop this question. This is our opinion, and uh, it's going to tell you uh, and give you a good indication of the level of interest. Um, it's also going to light a fire, create some some excitement. This question is going to be backed up by the presentation that you're just about to see. So if you can imagine a prospect, they've been asked the question, they've been shown the information, and then you can provide them with an actual plan of action, a business plan, so that they can visualize and see exactly how they can get from where they are at the moment to being an eagle manager and moving their business massively forward from that position okay so the question is the company I work with is expanding and they have some amazing income opportunities if I could show you a way by working just one hour a day in the nooks and crannies of your time you could be earning two thousand to three thousand per month within the next six months then increase that to somewhere between five and ten thousand per month within 12 to 24 months from now would that be of interest to you okay so you can you can ask that question word for word and i wouldn't advise changing it too much it's a question that demands a yes or no answer and the way that they answer that question is going to give you a, a real indication of their level of interest where they are at the moment and where they would like to see themselves okay now um, if they say yes to that question then say this I'm looking for just a few people to work with right now if I gave you all the information and you like what you see could you find an hour a day to get started with me again you know this is asking the question so if you like what you see is the timing right could you find an hour a day to get started now and work with me? That's what you're asking them. So uh, if they say yes, you can then add them to the groups and start tagging them information. Or maybe they're already in the groups and you can move them on to the next stage. But if they say no to the question, 
then um, just say, well, okay, uh, obviously the timing's not good for you at the moment, so let's keep in touch, and then we'll proceed when it's a better time. Let them see that you're busy, your success is not going to be determined by their interest. If there's one thing that we know is going to motivate people more than anything, is them seeing you getting the success that they would love to have. So it might be three months, six months, 12 months down the road. You just keep in touch with them. Let them know how you're doing. At some point, they're going to feel, now I really need to take a look at this. So the first thing we need to do, if you're just brand new in the business, just getting started, we need to get you to supervisor as soon as possible. And then on to manager, then on to eagle manager. This plan is going to be based on the basics of our business. As far as case credits are concerned, um, if you're new in the business, you don't completely under understand case credits, get your sponsor to direct you to the video explaining case credits in the Global Life Choices Academy. What we want you to do is to start off by using and retailing two case credits per month, then increase that to three case credits within two or three months. Okay. Plus, we want you to sponsor one new FBO in the first two weeks of every month. And that FBO is probably going to do another two case credits by the end of that registration month. We also want you to sponsor a second FBO who purchases their starter pack to become an assistant supervisor in the second two weeks of the month. So using and retailing two case credits Increase that to three, sponsor two people, one in the first two weeks, one in the second two weeks. And if you take daily action, which we're going to talk about in a moment, using the groups, using the chat groups, using your support that you've got available, you should be able to smash that goal. The first thing is, in the academy, it talks about the, um, the ATM system that we have in place, and you need to be doing your 553 system on a daily basis. What that means is that you're going to connect up and message five new people every day via social media, Facebook probably. And then you're going to also invite five people that you've been talking to, been communicating with, um, to join the groups every day. Five people that are interested in finding out more about the products, more about the opportunity. You've either already popped the question to them, or you can pop the question to them after they join the groups. It's your choice. Uh, if you invite five people, three are going to join. You can then start to tag them information, part one, part two, follow up. That's the process of you know, communicating with people on a daily basis. Okay, now getting to supervisor, you've got to achieve 25 case credits, you and your team, within a two-month period to get to supervisor. You don't have to take two months. We actually did it in a month. Some people um, take two months. Some people take a couple of months to build up to doing it over two months. You know, you have to go at your own pace. Okay, but if you're adding three people a day to the groups and tagging them information, think about it. Three people a day, let's say six days a week, okay, that's 18 people a week you're adding to the groups. That's 72 people a month. Now, some of those people are going to be really interested in earning more money or buying products and becoming a customer. So in your first month, you personally are going to um, use one case credit and create some customers, which will be another case credit. So you're going to use and retail two case credits. You might use half a case credit and retail one and a half case credits, but use and retail two case credits. Okay, you're going to sponsor your first person in the first two weeks of the month because you're doing that daily action and you're working with your sponsor who's helping you. Okay, so this is uh, a new FBO in your team that wants to do what you're doing. They purchase their starter pack and then they they uh, do another two case credits worth of business uh, by the end of that month. Okay, and then what you also do is you sponsor another FBO because you're still taking that daily action every day and you sponsor that second person in the second part of the month. 
in what we call your base month, which is month one, um, you've, you've actually achieved eight case credits towards the 25 you need to go supervisor. So in your qualifying month for supervisor, that's month two, you start off with a clean sheet, you've got two people in your team, and uh, what you're going to do, you're going to increase in your second month what you did in your first month. In other words, you're still going to use one case credit, but now you're going to uh, increase your customer base from one case credit to two case credits, because you'll get repeat orders from the ones the previous month, you keep doing what you did in the first month to get another one case credit's worth of customers. So that adds up to three case credits. You also sponsor another per a person in the first two weeks of that month who, do who purchases their pack plus another two case credits by the end of that month. And you sponsor one other person in the second part of that month who purchases their pack two case credits. A is going to copy what you're doing. Okay, so what you did in your first two months, use and retail two case credits. Sponsor one person in the first part of your second month, which is their first month. And they sponsor one other person. Now, of course, they're not doing that by themselves because you are helping them. And also your sponsor or your upline is helping you and them as well. Plus, you've got the system and all the support in the GLC groups. Now, we're going to assume in this presentation that not everybody is going to be what we call active. So it might be that B gets off to a slow start, uh, doesn't sponsor anybody, and only does one case credit in business in that month. Okay, so we're not, we're not assuming everybody's going to do everything all the time. Okay, 50% of the people in this presentation are going to be not active. Okay, hopefully you'll have a better result than that. So uh, simply by doing that, you've now got a group total for the month of 18 case credits. Over the two months, if you add the 18 to the 8, that's 26, and you actually required 25 case credits to go supervisor. Congratulations, you're now a supervisor, you're on your way to manager. First important part of that plan. So what we need to do now is get you from supervisor to assistant manager. So here we are in month three, which is your base month to go assistant manager. You've got six people in your team. You start off with a clean slate. What you're going to do is you're going to repeat what you did the month before. So use and retail three case credits, sponsor one person in the first half of the month, sponsor another one in the second, the one you sponsored in the first half, um, get started and does two case credits worth of business. They might have sold two case credits worth of products or they might have sponsored a person in their team. We're saying that, that D is getting off to a slow start and only did one case credit, didn't sponsor anybody. Okay, C is, um, is copying what you did. Use and retail two, sponsor one in the first part of the month. And the reason they can do this is because they're taking that daily action of communicating with five people, inviting five people to the group, three join, tag them information. You know, that's 72 people having information during the month. That's including days off, which is enough for you to sponsor your two people. You know, if you don't add three people a day to the groups, you're probably not going to sponsor two people. It's an equation. Action equals results. But remember, you can do all this in an hour a day what we call a power hour. Um, so we've got B there, off to a slow start, does another one case credit, and you've got A, who actually copies what you do, and the two people in A's team, you know, one's not being active, and the other one gets off to a flying start, copying what you're doing and what A's doing. Okay, so 50% of the people here are not active, the other 50% are doing what you're doing, um, being active on a daily basis, and uh, adding 72 people a month to the group and sponsoring at least two. They might sponsor three or four with, with 72 people looking at information, especially as you get good and better at doing it. Okay, so here is your base month to go assistant manager. Assistant manager is achieving 75 case credits over a two-month period. In this month, your base month, okay, is you've done 
37 out of the 75. Again, you know, I want to emphasize we are assuming that 50% of the people that come into your business are going to be a, getting off to a slow start. Um, they're not going to be active. It might not be 50%. It might only be 20%. But we're just trying to be realistic in this presentation, but still make it very exciting and very doable. Okay, so now we move into month four, which is your qualifying month to become assistant manager. You can see how many people are in your team now. Some of those are active. Some of those are not active. Okay, and we start off the month with a clean slate. So I'm just going to whisk through this now because we're just following the same pattern. You're going to do exactly the same thing again this month in month four. Use and retail three case credits, sponsor two people, one in the first part of the month, the other one in the second part of the month. And then throughout your team, some of them are going to be active and some of them are going to be uh, not so active. But everybody is just copying the same Pattern. At least 50% of them are doing what you're doing with the support that they've got. And these are the results that you will get. We've got C there creating those case credits like you did. A is copying exactly what you're doing. You can see how A's business is growing now. And especially in this month, you know, which is your fourth month, it's A's third month. You can see <coughs> simply by copying what you're doing, how the case credits and the team members are growing. Now I want to emphasize here, if you look at that business now, okay, we're saying that just half of them, 50% of those people are active, but the other 50% are getting off to a slow start. Um, actually, the other 50% getting off to a slow start are going to get motivated when they say you and some of your team members um, getting the results that they would love to have simply by spending an hour a day communicating with five people, inviting five to the groups, three join, and you sponsoring two people. And the excitement that you've got um, is also going to create customers for the products. So here you are now, the end of uh, month four. You can see that A does 37 case credits in this month like you did last month. Okay, your total case credits for the whole group is actually 69 in month four. You only required 45 to get to the assistant manager level. And you've got a lot, of, a lot of leeway there. Even if you didn't achieve the 69 and we want you to do that, if it was 59, you're still going to smash the 45. If it was 50, you're still going to smash the 45. We're allowing for the fact that people, some people are just, you know, maybe the timing is not so perfect. Something's happened in their life to stop them doing what they want to do. Whatever the reason is, it's not a perfect world. We have the same in our business as in other businesses. Okay, so when we go into month five, and congratulations now, you are an assistant manager. When we go into month five, I'm not going to draw the diagram because you can see how big the team's getting and the page is going to get a bit cramped. Okay, so here we are. Um, I'm just going to explain. Um, we've gone through month one, two, three, and four. Month one was eight case credits. Month two was 18. Month three, in this example, was 37, but you only needed 30 that month. And in month four, you just needed 45, but you did 69. So eight... 18, 37, 69. The next month should grow from 69 to over 120. Okay, but what if it was just 100? What if it was just 80? That is still phenomenal, and all you're doing is spending an hour a day communicating with five people, inviting five people to the groups, three join. 72 join a month, and out of those, you're going to sponsor two people, one in the first half and one in the second half of the month. It's a pretty simple but very powerful plan. You know, you can see there's plenty of room for margin in this plan with these figures. Now, um, here we are. We're just at the beginning of June. 
So month one, let's say, is June. Month two is July. Month three is August. Month four is September. Month five is October. So now as a manager, and hopefully your business at this stage is doing well over 100 case credits a month, and you can see how that can happen, okay, you've now got six months to get from manager to eagle manager, and your eagle manager qualification starts the day that you become manager. You need to do 720 case credits from the day that you went manager by the end of April 2023 for you to reach the eagle manager position. Now, if we look at month four and five, during that period, you required 120 case credits in order for you to get to the manager position, but you actually did 189. Okay, so we can take 69 of those case credits and put them towards the 720 that you require in order to get to the Eagle Manager over the next six month period. And then we can work out the average per month as to what you need to do to reach that position. Divide that into one, two, three, four, five, six. That works out an average of 108.5 case credits a month. Now, hopefully, you did over 120 in month five. So 108 is going to be a doddle for this six month period per month. It's going to grow to 200, 250. You know, you can smash that Eagle Manager position simply by communicating with five inviting five to the groups, three will join, sponsor two people a month, and obviously use and retail three case credits. I mean, this is so powerful, but the key is being consistent and active on a daily basis. One hour a day and make that hour productive. You know, everything's in place for you to do this. Okay. So here, um, just to reflect now, okay, month one and two, you got to supervisor. Month three and four, you got to assistant manager. And month five and uh, four and five, you got to manager. You can take your qualifying month in month four to go assistant manager. You can also use that as your base month to qualify for manager the following month. Now, a manager that is doing 70 case credits a month is going to be earning about £1,750, euros or dollars a month. If you're doing 100 case credits, that income is going to be about 2500 If you're doing 150, it's going to be about 3750 per month. Plus, you're going to start qualifying for the incentives. Now, remember... You've got two options to get to manager. Option one is to do 120 case credits over t uh, within two months. Option two, uh, you can do 150 case credits within four months. That's probably the easier option, but we want you to go for option one on this plan. The Eagle Manager qualification period runs from the 1st of May to the 30th of April each year. But if you're not a manager yet, it starts the day you get to the manager position. So the quicker you do that, the more time you have to get to Eagle Manager. As an Eagle Manager, you're awarded the title at the beginning of May, and it will last for 12 months. So you have to qualify for Eagle Manager every year. But if you've got a good business, it, you would just automatically qualify. You must be 4CC active from the month that you reach the manager position. So if you miss a month being active, we hope you won't. But if you do, prior to getting to manager, that won't affect getting Eagle Manager. As long as you're active 4CC every month from the day you get to manager and you do the qualification, you become Eagle Manager. To qualify, you must do 720 after you get to manager by the 30th of April. You're going to smash that on this plan. Okay, this must include 100 cc in new personally sponsored. So that means after you get to manager, you must sponsor one or two or three people where well, you're going to sponsor two every month. 
okay, and between those people create 100 case credits and that's part of the 720. And when you reach the Eagle Manager position, you're awarded the, uh, a trip to the Eagle Manager's Retreat, which is somewhere different in the world every year. Next year, it's actually in Thailand, and it's for two people, all expenses pay, including flights, hotel, and you just have a fantastic time mixing with other successful Eagle Managers and learning from them, partying with them, and just making friends with them. So all the CCs are counted globally. So this is something new. Um, it used to have to be done in your home country, but now you can count all the case credits from all the countries around the world. So if you've got somebody in the UK and you've got somebody in Spain and you've got somebody in Portugal and you've got somebody in Romania, you can add it all up together. You count your global case credits, not your country case credits. So Eagle Managers earn 3,000 to 5,000 per month, and obviously that's going to increase. They qualify for the Eagle Managers Retreat. They qualify for the Earned Incentive, the car plan. They qualify for the Global Rally every year, which is another trip somewhere different in the world. Next year, that's actually in Bali. This year, it was in Abu Dhabi. Again, that's two people all expenses paid, five-star flights, uh, including spending money. Simply by doing what you've seen in this plan will get you on that trip. Getting to Eagle Manager as the stepping stone to qualify for a chairman's bonus check, which, which can double, treble, or quadruple or more your annual income, just that having that bonus. Okay. So the question you've got to ask yourself, is it worth doing the basics? Is it worth adding three people to the groups every day? Contact five, invite five, three will join. Is it worth being consistent with your messaging and following up, follow-ups? Is it worth um, you know, creating a messenger group, a chat group, with each individual prospect, that's you, your sponsor, and the prospect, so that your sponsor can see what's going on with you and your prospect. They can add some input. They can support and help you to do this. Okay, You must allow your upline to help you. You're in business for yourself, but certainly not by yourself. And uh, it's also important, in addition to your hour a day, um, to attend the Global Life Choices events. On a Monday night, we've got the... Uh, the product showcase, uh, which is about 45 minutes. And on a Thursday night, we've got uh, training, which is another 45 minutes. You know, if you want to get to Eagle Manager, you must attend those two events every week. Prioritize it, make it important, put it in your diary, and show up. If you do those things, if you do what you can see on the page right now, you will be Eagle Manager this, uh, by the end of April next year. The important part about this is don't think about the outcome. Just get on with the daily activity. It's what we call marry the process and divorce the outcome. Don't worry about the outcome. Let the, out, let the process sort out the outcome. You know, if you're adding three people per day, six days a week to the groups, and you can add more if you want to, Okay, that's 72 people a month. If you tag them the correct information, involve your sponsor, you're going to get at least two of those people join your team. I mean, that's just the way it works. I'd be very surprised if it's not three or four. So guys, I hope you got inspired by this presentation. This is exactly how it works. This is how... Jeff and Jean have built their business. It's how we built our business. It's just doing the basics. And don't worry about the outcome. Don't worry about looking at the size of the team in month four or month six. Just concentrate this month on you using and retailing two or three case credits and sponsoring two people because you added three people per day to the groups. That's all you've got to focus on. But do it every day, every week, every month. 
between now and the end of next April and don't stop next April either because you can move your income to six figures then. Right guys, um, that's it. I'm sure you're going to have loads of questions. We're going to have one-to-ones, um, lots of planning sessions and uh, we're going to have a special group formed especially for the people that want to go for this so that we can communicate together as a team. Team is together, everybody achieves more. Let's get you all to manager and eagle manager. We'll catch you on the next video, guys. Bye for now.